engineering physics lab experiment number 6 magnetic field intensity the aim of the experiment is to verify the value of horizontal component of earth's magnetic field vh and to determine magnetic field intensity at the center of coil coil carrying current by deflection method apparatus required the circular coil the current meter the rheostat magnetic compass and the power supply coming to the circuit connection so we have to verify the value of horizontal component of earth's magnetic field vh for this we need power supply the current meter the circular coil and the rheostat we have to connect everything in series end to end connection connect from power supply to uh, the current meter current meter to coil coil to the rheostat in turn rheostat to the we connect positive terminal of the power supply to the positive terminal of the current meter and negative terminal of the current meter to the negative terminal of the circular coil and positive of the circular coil to the one terminal of the rheostat we have to use in the rheostat different terminals now i should not use this i should use the upper terminal since i have used a down down terminal already connect one end of the rio start to the uh, power supply now everything is connected this is about circuit connection now we know that the current carrying wire generates a magnetic field according to biot's sort's law first we have to adjust the apparatus in the magnetic meridian uh, this can be done as follows place the compass box on the slider At x equal to zero, rotate the compass such that 90 degree and 90 degree are parallel to each other, as shown here. To the plane of the circular coil, rotate all operators in the horizontal plane. Make the aluminium pointer to read zero and zero. You can observe here. Rotate the complete operators such that those two aluminium terminals should show zero and zero. You can observe here. Once it is done, now the apparatus is in the magnetic meridian, and the coil, needle, and its image all lie in the same vertical plane. Now, vary the rheostat according to Ohm's law. The current also varies, and try to keep it to any one a uh, constant value. It is uh, saturated value. If it shows one point something, it is not a correct value. Vary it. now you can observe one point uh, 3 or something keep it to any one constant well either 1 uh, amps or 2 uh, amps uh, let me uh, vary it uh, let me uh, keep it to approximately 1 2 uh, or 3 i'll keep it to Okay, let me keep it to approximately one point two. Okay, now once it is uh, kept to any one constant value, uh, note down the deflection produced by the magnetic compass. You can observe. Let me call it as theta one and theta two. It is seventy uh, five. Theta one. The first one will be theta one, and the second one will be theta two. Seventy five and seventy five is uh, showing. now change the polarity of the current goes to the circular coil connect from positive to negative negative to uh, positive change the direction of the current now whatever uh, the deflection the opposite deflection it produces uh, that will be your theta 3 and theta 4 initially it was theta 1 theta 2 and once you change the direction of the current now it will be theta 3 and theta 4 wait until it uh, goes to rest now it is uh, approximately 55 theta 3 and theta 4 is 56 note down the values initially it is uh, theta 1 theta 2 and this and the in this reading it is theta 3 and theta 4 coming to tabular column current we can keep it any one constant value in this example it is kept to 1.0 x sir The distance was uh, zero, and theta one, theta two, theta three, 
it a 4 I have to move down here and take the average of all these 4 and express it as uh, average theta in degrees and B in Tesla the magnetic field which is produced I choose a formula and as magnetic field whatever the magnetic field it produces divided by tan theta is deflection this one ok express it in Tesla and uh, this is one of the uh, model tabular problem which have done the readings already calculation uh, number of turns in the coil it will be given radius of the coil also it will be given distance between the center of the coil and the pointer compass it was kept to uh, 0 initially permittivity of phase space mu not equal to 4 pi to 10 power minus 7 is constant value current to the coil uh, you can keep it to any one either 1 amps or 2 amps or 1.5 amps to calculate the uh, magnetic field we have the formula mu not n i divided by 2 into a square divided by a square plus x square to the power of 3 by 2 here in the first reading the x value will be uh, 0 and uh, this complete term will be reduced to 1 by a the complete term will be reduced to 1 by a if you substitute 0 here okay this 2 this 2 cancels 2 and 3 remaining is 1 by a okay? and bh equal to b by tan theta whatever the value you will get from here and substitute to this divided by tan the average value of deflection you will get as magnetic field okay this is a good calculation part results whatever the value you get magnetic field intensity at the center and first my horizontal magnetic field both both in 